from the royal gardens of Persia to the sacred icon of Hindu gods. It is a living tapestry woven from a thousand eyes. This bird is not merely beautiful. It is a paradox, an evolutionary statement written in the language of light. The peacock's beauty is built on a physical lie and it uses a secret sound your ears cannot even hear. From the royal gardens of Persia to the sacred icon of Hindu gods, it is a living tapestry woven from a thousand eyes. This bird is not merely beautiful, it is a paradox, an evolutionary statement written in the language of light. We think we know the peacock, but today, we look past the curtain and see the truth behind the splendor. The first truth, peacock is not a single species. When you picture a peacock, you are picturing the Indian peafowl, Pavo cristatus, the soul of India, with its iconic fan-shaped crest and its unmistakable piercing call. But deep in the jungles of Southeast Asia, a true warrior hides. This is the green peafowl, taller, more formidable. Both male and female are cloaked in iridescent emerald. Its crest is not a fan, but a tight cluster of arrows. A proud warrior, now critically endangered and the most elusive, deep in Africa's Congo Basin, the Congo peafowl. A closely guarded secret, a distant, different cousin of deep blue and copper. We call the male a peacock, the female a peahen, and the species is peafowl. This distinction is the key to all their secrets. The female, the peahen, is a lesson in humility, a master of camouflage. Her feathers are the color of dirt, of bark, of silence. She exists not to be seen. She exists to secure the future. But the male, the male is a bonfire, a festival. He is evolution's greatest risk and his biggest secret is hidden in plain sight. This is not his tail. What you are admiring is called the train. It grows from its back. Over 200 intricate feathers. The real tail is here. Short, stiff, and invisible. Its job is to be a platform, a stage, for nature's grandest performance. Secret two, this color does not exist. It is an illusion. If you were to grind this feather to dust, you would find no blue, no green pigment. You would be left with a pile of grayish brown. The color you see is not chemistry. It is physics. It is called structural color. On every barb are millions of nanoscopic structures, smaller than a wavelength of light. They are perfectly arranged like tiny crystals when white light strikes them. These structures shatter it. They filter and reflect only the most brilliant blue and green wavelengths. It is not paint, it is a living prism. And the performance begins. The male turns his stage into a shimmering wall of light and sound. The eye spots, Ocelli, are not just decoration, they are a message. And then she arrives, the peahen, the animal kingdom's harshest critic. She is not looking for beauty. She is conducting a genetic audit. She counts. How many eye spots? Are they symmetrical? Is the train brilliant? Because this train is an enormous burden. It attracts predators. It hinders flight. It costs a staggering amount of energy to grow. And this is the key. Every year, after the season is over, 
The male molts this entire masterpiece. He drops it and must grow it all back. That is his message. I am so healthy. I can afford to waste all this energy on something useless and dangerous. I can survive despite this burden. My genes are superior, but the visual display is only half the story. It is also a concert that we cannot hear. As the peacock shivers his train, he creates a rhythm, a low frequency drum beat, infrasound. It travels through the ground further than his call, a vibration that the female can feel. It is the baseline of seduction. But what of this? A ghost, a peafowl of pure white. Is it an albino? Number, look at its eyes. They are blue, not pink. This is a genetic mutation called leucism, a glitch in the code that stops pigment melanin from being deposited in the feathers. And here's the magic. The crystal structures are still there, but without the dark pigment base, they cannot shatter the light. They simply reflect the entire spectrum back. The result is pure white, the beauty of absence. From here, humans have stepped in, breeding the pied, the cameo, and the black-shouldered, turning a natural icon into a living work of art. When the performance is over, the final truth is revealed. The peacock flies, and it flies well. Despite the weight of its beauty, it is a survivor, an omnivore, that will readily devour insects, lizards, and even small snakes. And its call, that harsh, unpleasant scream, is a reminder that beauty and the brutality of survival always go hand in hand. It is not an ornament. It is a warrior in an armor made of light. Armor made of beauty it is never superficial. In nature, it is a biological cipher written in the language of physics. If this video changed how you see a peacock forever, help us share this hidden language. Which peacock secret amazed you the most? Comment below. And if you, like us, believe nature is the greatest story ever told, join our family, subscribe, and never stop exploring.